Around the World in 80 Days is a video game developed by Pick Up and Play for mobile phones, and by Sapphire Corporation for Game Boy Advance. It is an adaptation of the 2004 film of the same name starring Jackie Chan. The game features pre-rendered characters and graphics, and a password feature for returning to specific levels. Like the film, the game set in the 19th century, and the player assumes the role of Passepartout, portrayed by Jackie Chan, a Chinese valet hired by an eccentric inventor Phileas Fogg, Steve Coogan, in efforts to circumnavigate the world in 80 days. Topic. Gameplay Around the World in 80 Days is a side-scrolling action-adventure game. Set in the 19th century, it features pre-rendered sprites, and follows almost the film's storyline and most of its locations. In the game, the player controls Passepartout, a Chinese valet hired by an inventor Phileas Fogg in attempts to circumnavigate the world in 80 days. During gameplay, the player encounters various enemies along the way, including warriors sent by General Fang. There are four blue symbols scattered throughout each level. The player must collect all four of these symbols in order to advance to the next level. Collecting them also increases the length of the health bar. The health bar depletes when being attacked by enemies or traps. When emptied, one of the remaining lives, dubbed as vials, in-game, is used automatically. An extra vial is granted if the player collects 80 golden coins scattered throughout the game. The Game Boy Advance's R, A and B buttons are used for kicking, punching and jumping, respectively. Pressing the select button at any point will display the controls. Passepartout can perform various actions, such as sliding, jumping from wall to wall, and grabbing ledges. The player can also attack while jumping or crouching. The game uses a password function, which allows the player to return to a specific level in the game. Topic. Development and release A video game based on the film Around the World in 80 Days starring Jackie Chan was developed for the Game Boy Advance by Sapphire Corporation, a game studio based in American Fork, Utah. It was designed by Jeremy Throckmorton, Alex Rushton and Brandon Harmon, and programmed by Hal Rushton, Dion McClung and Karen Willard. Sapphire utilized a technique to render digitized sprites, as done on their video game adaptation of the 2004 film, Van Helsing. The game was announced by its publisher Hip Games in May 2004, stating that it would ship with the film's release in North America on June 22, 2004. The European version was released on October 15, 2004. Topic. Reception According to the review aggregation website Metacritic, the Game Boy Advance version received generally unfavorable reviews. Mark Nix of IGN described the gameplay as a slobberknocker and stated that fighting with boss characters are just slugfests, some of which may prove too difficult to brawl through for young gamers even though the rest of the game is a cakewalk. However, Levi Buchanan of the same site said that the mobile version isn't even close to being the worst movie game on cell phones, but it's a far shot from the best. Average to the core, and likely not worth your download dollars. Tim Saradsky of GameZone wrote a positive review. He noted that the GBA version is easy enough that kids will enjoy playing it and praised its graphics, which looks very good for the GBA.